वेलकम टू मरीन टेक हब टूडे आई एल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट एम ई इंजिन विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू पी वी यू पी वी यू इज नथिंग बट पंप वेपराइजर यूनिट दिस इज फॉर एम ई जी आई स्लैश एम ई जी आई ई इज एथेनॉल ओके सो दिस इज द यूनिट विच यू आर हैविंग एंड यू कैन सी वन टू थ्री these are the hydraulic actuators so we will be discussing on this in more detail so next slide uh, we go to the next slide here so this is a uh, little bit on the me me engine you can see the lng tank here lng is liquid natural gas so the liquid will be stored at a temperature of minus 162 degrees from here we got a lp pump low pressure pump from here the we are using the pump then it goes to the filter lng filter here then it goes to the hp pump high pressure pump or you can say hydraulic actuator normally uh, this hp pump what it does it actually uh, makes the liquid into the gas and uh, we are using the hp vaporizer high pressure this high pressure vaporizer uh, we are using glycol filter and we are heating the glycol and we have a pump so this is circulated and uh, to heat the liquid to convert into vapor okay from here if you see this hp pump hp pump is operated by the hydraulic system see hydraulic oil supply okay this hydraulic oil supply can be run by electric so we have a hydraulic oil supply which is coming and will activate the hp pump here from here hp vaporizer the gas is coming up here to gvt that is gas valve train okay this is again controlled by mecs this is engine control system and again we have the whole system pv v is controlled by pv u control system and then this is connected to f g s s fuel gas supply system we have a control system here so if you see here what is written the pump vaporizing unit is a unit of the f g s s again fgss is fuel gas supply system which fills up the dedicated tank by raising the pressure from the lp pump to the injection pressure of the megi slash megi e engine to 250 to 380 bar and heats the lng to vaporize to a gas or at a temperature of 35 to 55 degrees okay so when it is coming here it will be at this temperature so next i will go to the next slide where you will see again we have so many controls here you can see this is the pvu pump vaporizing unit and we have fgss then we have something called s hps this is stand alone hydraulic power supply okay so this is again controlled by the pvv control system here this is electric equipment room and this again is connected to the mob okay main operating panel then we have something called the ics integral control system then this is what it is ics is again attached to this then we have something called the esd emergency shut down in case any problem is happening the gas safety system will shut down the system and immediately the engine will change from gas to fuel okay guys so this is the one so i will try and tell more about it so if you see here these 1 2 and 3 so if you see the first one is running and the second one is revert reverting and the third one is if you see stand standby 
so one will always be running the second one will be reverting we got the hydraulic pump here supply and uh, you can see the accumulator here so we got a control system PV unit control system then once it is going it is heated up you can the heating system gas outlet it is measured so this is one of the important thing on the MEGA engine where we will be having this hydraulic actuator which will be converting the liquid to vapor and we are heating up by glycol ok guys uh, this is the part 2 of the video and if you like the video please subscribe and I am helping most of the engineers all over the world uh, for troubleshooting so please if you have any issues you can call me my number is crawling and uh, my email address is there ok guys have a nice day thank you very much